Hi guys, you're welcome to Delaware Studios. This is another episode of Android programming. We're still on the Android Material Design Basics. Are looking at the activity transition with uh, mid mention of the image transform, the slide, the explode, and the last but not the least will be the change text. You know, these are the four major aspects of the activity transition that we'll be talking about. So let's look at the change text and uh, let's incorporate it into the recycler view list and we get to see how it works. So I'll be moving straight to the layout. We have the XML. Now I'm going to create one XML that will undo the change text. I'm going to name it fragment. change text this way so I'm going to actually create this and uh, let's go to the text we have the default as linear layout uh, which will actually be changing uh, we'll need to change this linear layout to a frame we actually need it to uh, be enclosed in a frame. So let's quickly do that. Change this linear to frame. That's fine. Now we have the uh, structure set. So we need an ID. Android ID. And uh, we need to set an ID. So we give the ID, the name called Transitions Container. So just let us have that done. Set. Uh, we're going to take it with the orientation. Actually, don't need it. Now, the layout with tonight match parents. That's all we need. Now, we're going to bring in a text view. Layout with tonight match parent. And wrap content. We'll assign an ID. to give a padding twenty DB we to give a text size twenty five SP As well, we're going to give it text color. What we call the color primary text. Set up quickly. From here, we'll be moving to the Java class, and uh, we're actually going to check out the main activity. Before we head straight to the activity involved for the chain text, now let's register the default case, which will be return. Same thing goes with the fragment. Yes. Okay. It's on. 
new. Change text. Name. Now from here we'll create an activity called change text transition. Just click on create activity. New job class. Change text transition. This extends Fragment and uh, we need to have some fields public, static, final, string, the first text, score one equals two, Android. Material Design Basics Another one Public Static Final String Text two was to activity transition chain text that's fine now let's build it up mollable let's override we have the view public View Layout Inflator View Inflator Just like the way we did for others View Group Data Now we're going to call the view. Request to the inflator. Now we inflate. Call the layout. Fragments. Change text. Container. Set it this way for the final view group transitions container plus two view group. The view, find view by ID, our ID transitions container. Final text view, it's an object. Get a transition container to find the view by now pass our ID text one. 
Now we got the text. Set text. Text one. Call the text view. Set on click list now. And uh, we instantiate with a new view. We have a boolean before create the long click and second, which is either true or false. So toggle, we need to toggle as a sense of this boolean. Now we've got the override. a context equals to not and it's a context transition manager begin now we call transition container comma the new Transform. Now we call that change behavior out in. What's this way? Still call the text view. Set text. And second text. So if Sketch with Paris Derby. This is just like an if statement. You know, is it the first one or the second one? Is that takes two or one. That's the scenario. Text one. So just this way. Now we need to return. Oh, we still need a Android transition, uh, which will be for the transition manager instead of this particular one we need for the transition. We need Actually, don't need this one. Now let me import it from the library transition everywhere. So we need it for this. That's fine. So that's set appropriately. So is it a once you click on the first text, you know the second text comes up. Once you click on the second, the first text comes up with the app of this itinerary statement. You know. That's just what that does. When you call on the fragment that has this layout to hold on to this structure. Let's go back to main activity. Fine, that's gone. So I'm actually going to show this in an emulator. Let's see how the chain text uh, animation actually flows.
Okay, she said the solution is material design basics, which is actually uh, the first text right the Sandrine material design basics. So on this we change transition change text for the second text. Can you see that? So that's just uh, what that depicts. So we have it right there. So you click back again, takes you back to the Android material design basics. So that's just how to make uh, a change text transition from one text to the other. You know, this is just uh, all it takes to incorporate uh, activity transition into your material design enabled application. So thank you very much for hanging out with me throughout this uh, tutorial session. And uh, I hope you actually learned a lot from this uh, from the package, majorly in the activity transition. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and have a pleasant time.